a boy named Joe, and fossil fuels were in love. They did everything together. But after a while, his friends started badmouthing fossil fuels. They started spreading rumors and blaming her for everything bad in the world. So Joe decided to break up with fossil fuels, even though she had done so much for him. As soon as she was gone, Joe realized that life was very different without fossil fuels. Joe went to call his friends, but his phone had disappeared. He wanted to jump online to log on to a dating site, but that didn't work either. He was feeling a little sad. So he went to the kitchen to get something to eat, but without fossil fuels, he didn't have many options. Joe quickly realized that without fossil fuels, his home didn't seem much like home anymore. A group of anti-energy activists, led by Bill McKibben, wants you to break up with fossil fuels this Valentine's Day. But breaking up is hard to do, when fossil fuels make most things in life possible. Fossil fuels provide 80% of our energy, and are integral to consumer goods ranging from clothes to beauty products. Visit BigGreenRadicals.com and find out more about why you shouldn't break up with fossil fuels this Valentine's Day.